So T cells are the soldiers of our immune system. They go around our body looking for signs of trouble, such as infected cells through pathogens or abnormal cell growth as in cancer. And once they find such danger signals, they become activated and ready to fight and keep us healthy. So generally T cells are calm and kept in a quiescent state. But when they see such danger, they become activated and ready to fight. And what we found in this study is a new molecule called BH4, which is important in the transition from calm to aggressive in the T cells. BH4 has traditionally been studied in the nervous system, where it's very important in producing neurotransmitters such as serotonin and dopamine. But we now found a completely novel role in a completely novel cell type, the T cell. So what we show is that when T cells are transitioning from calm to aggressive, they need a lot of BH4. So what we actually did is that we found a way to turn down the amount of BH4 in the T cell. And in this way, the T cells went from aggressive to calm. And this is very important in diseases such as allergic inflammation and autoimmune conditions such as colitis or asthma. Because in these conditions, the T cells are constantly aggressive. But by giving, lowering the amounts of BH4, we can completely turn it down. Conversely, in terms of cancer, you want your T cells to be very aggressive. And so what we actually showed in the paper again is that by increasing and then turning up the amount of BH4, the T cells were more aggressive and were able to fight the cancer much more aggressively. So this is very important clinical implications because the way we can turn BH4 down, we actually developed a brand new novel drug to do this. And also by turning it up, there's a drug already out there used for a completely different purpose. So in this way, we can pharmacologically modulate and control the T cells, cool them down, autoimmune diseases, or heat them up in terms of cancer.